I'm like. <laughs> I want the pink one. It's a little windy, we're under the fan, but contraction update. Still about every five minutes for maybe a minute. Um, but they're not getting real painful, just like uncomfortable. You gotta concentrate on your breathing through it. I don't know. I don't know. I guess we'll see how it goes. They're not getting closer together, I don't think. It's hard to monitor when you're like holding kids and stuff. So we just got home from the birthday party. Rachel has number one pick in our fantasy draft. And what did you just say? Shake one. Yes. Shaquan? Are you serious? You're really not going to get Patrick Mahomes? Um, well, you're making me, you're making me rethink it now. Are you not dedicated to your Chiefs? Of course I am. Do you and not? I've actually thought about that, like how fun would it be to watch Yeah, of course. Mahomes as, I mean, a lot of contractions. Seriously? Yes. But they're not like getting more painful. Wait, I'm just going to sit in mind. More importantly, we're talking about fantasy okay, football. sorry. Let's <laughs> Put that, let's table that conversation for a minute. Get back to fantasy football. Um, should I pick Mahomes? Yes, of course. Really? Yes. What's he Are ranked? You that because you're against me? No. He's way down the list of like, if we're talking number one picks, you never pick a quarterback first. You pick a running back. Yeah, but this might. They're way more lucrative. Yeah, but you're a huge Chiefs fan. I know, but I want to win. Of course I'm a huge cheese fan. Yeah, team. he's number 43 ranked overall. Do you think I could get him the next round? Or will someone take him? Yeah, someone's- Can we send out an, a group text and say like, let Rage get Mahomes for the second pick? <laughs> that would be hilarious. Can that happen? You're the commissioner, could you just block him from being picked until it's my turn again? Uh, heck no. <laughs> Rachel is officially on the clock and she got Patrick Mahomes. Patrick Mahomes! Bright and early on Monday, Labor Day morning. What are you up to? It is Monday. Don't you feel like we, we should be going to church today? Yeah, it feels like a Sunday. Weird. Um, we're making a large batch of balls. Right there. He's poured everything in so far. Almost. I showed him how to do it once. And then he's got this thing figured out. He may be a future chef. But you gotta be really careful. <sighs> what are you doing? Whoa! <laughs> I'm actually meal prepping. So I'm gonna smoke some chicken. And I'm not sure what else I'm gonna smoke. Uh, but some stuff for lunches throughout the week. I've been spending a lot of money on my lunches, and so I would much prefer to just bring my own lunch and save a little quiche, if you know what I mean. Uh, so yeah, I'll be smoking all day. Okay, so we have two giant batches of balls. I actually have enough to do a couple more batches, but you want more ball? <laughs> I probably should, because it's not just me eating them this time around. Right, Junebug? You want more ball? Lyndall just woke up. It's 8 o'clock. Very typical of her. You look disheveled. Your diaper's all... <laughs> Who did your diaper last night, Junebug? Oh, goodness. Oh. <laughs> Wrong pipe. Do you want another ball? Do you want another ball? Close it, close it, close it. Oh! 
<laughs> You're silly. <coughs> You're silly. Now you gotta open it. There you go. You want this ball? <laughs> it's like Bear's helping Dad sweep out there. Oh boy. Well, that's one way to drink water. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to explain what that is? That is the toilet bowl. <laughs> <laughs> Luckily, those weren't affected by the recall because they used oh, them all day, all the time. All day, all the time. <laughs> what? <laughs> Morning, Lindell. We're, we're struggling this morning. No Everyone kidding. is. Besides you and I. <laughs> Everyone in this house besides you and me. And, and Rusty and Iris, Iris and Mario. And Rusty. So. so I have two stir fry things going. Just a bunch of zucchini and summer squash. Along with some ground turkey that I fried up with garlic. And then all you do is, since the meat's cooked, it's... Uh, it's pretty easy. You just put in a couple cans of tomato and then top with Parmesan. I think you can put it over spaghetti squash if you want. How's it going out there? Going well. I'm doing some jalo, jalapeno peppers. Jalapeno. Jalapeno peppers. I like your hat. Thank you. That's actually from Dave and Val. Remember? And then the next thing on the agenda besides these two things is just a giant like vegetable beef stew. So I'm actually gonna make that, no I'm not. I'm just gonna do the meat, cut up the vegetables, put it all together just like that, but it'll be a stew instead of a stir fry. Pretty exciting. He jumped. He jumps every time. This looks like a blast in here. Yeah, we're having a lot of fun. Cool. Peekaboo! Lendl, can you say peekaboo? That's adorable. Hey, Iris! Peekaboo! Aww. What a mess. But there's been a lot accomplished. Here is vegetable beef soup, stew, soup. You just have to add broth. I'm gonna put it in this bag with this giant bag of carrots and that will all go together to make a nice beef soup. That's be hard for the kids to eat. <laughs> They'll probably be better with their spoons by then. A stir fry and another stir fry. You just add tomatoes, top with Parmesan and stir it fried, stir fry it. And then two big bags of veggies to put in a crock pot with a pot roast, or with a whatever you call, that big hunk of meat that you put in there with it. And I put like a packet of like pot roast seasoning in there too, so you really just have to add broth or water. That doesn't seem like very much for all the work I did this morning. Well, I mean, in addition to our Hello Fresh and then all these meals, how long do you think will it last us? I don't know. Um, I guess I also have a lasagna in there that I already made. This will probably be several meals. Well, and also these will eat. Yeah, these will each be a couple of meals. I want to do more bags of veggies, like what you can buy pre-cut, but just cut them myself. And then looks like you did some work over here. Yep. Green beans, huh? You're not doing like a Mexican theme? Yeah. Cool. That looks good. Yeah. You know what's ironic? No. I think we've heard we've worked harder today than any day the past year. And it's Labor Day. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Although it would be super ironic if you went into labor. That would be even more ironic. There's still time. Even the robot's like, come on guys, 
It's Labor Day. <laughs> <laughs> hey, robot, you missed the spot. You know it's Labor Day. Since Chris and Colleen were here, well, I taped a blanket up there while you were on your two weeks because I didn't want people seeing me in here. So, and then we tra transitioned to this beautiful sheet <laughs> curtain. curtain. And now, the final product. Cute. It's cute. Don't you think? Oh, gosh. There's only one right answer. It's the cutest thing I've ever seen. That's not the right answer. What about your wife? Cutest material, honey. Oh, okay. I think that goes well with this. Like the curtains and everything. Cute, honey. Yeah, it is cute. It looks green almost from like, I guess the trees being behind it. I don't know. Yeah, that's really adorable. Does it make it as dark as it did with the... Wow, the camera has no idea what to focus on. Okay, let's see. Oh, pretty good. Hmm. All done. So I'm showing the kids pictures. My parents just got back from their cruise to Alaska. And they went fishing. It's like a red snapper here. Ooh. Bear, bear one's front and center. Yeah. Look at that. Take fish. your word for it. Baby. Look at that fish. That's awesome. Look at its eyeball. Oh my gosh, that's really red. Yeah, that's crazy. Looks like they both Dang. Yeah. Fun. Yeah. The kids are really into it. Yeah. Lindell, you look like you're ready to go play basketball. Because <laughs> <laughs> she's standing. <laughs> Holy cow, look at it? that one. Look at that fish. Oh, man. Wow. That's huge. That is huge. Huh. Hey. Very cool. Mm -hmm. hey. Hi. <laughs> Bear, I can't see. <laughs> Whoa, look at that fish. Wendell, who gave this to you? <laughs> Annie. <laughs> Annie did. <laughs> That's right. That was so nice. <laughs> uh, are you rocking your baby? Can you rock your baby? Oh, that's so sweet. Bear, can you rock your baby? Oh. Your imaginary baby. Oh, good, good, good job. job. <laughs> we learned today that we absolutely cannot leave Lyndall alone with her baby brother or sister. I'll insert the picture here. <laughs> oh.